It's okay. Just breathe. You got this. Just breathe. It's a, it's a boy. It is Thanksgiving Day. I got my, I cut my hair, trimmed up my beard. It is the next day. It's actually Thanksgiving Day today. So, I feel and look much better than I did because I tried holding out to the end of November for that no shave November, but man, it was not working for me. Like, it's not my style and it was driving me crazy. But, like I said, it is Thanksgiving Day. Getting ready to start cooking the turkey, getting everything going. Got the turkey in here. We got our, it's hard to see. Got our turkey, got some extra meat, got some random stuff we're cooking, got our sweet potatoes down at the bottom there. My turkey is still a little bit frozen. Get out of here. Oh, it's really frozen on the inside. Yeah, it's still, it's still icy. This is ice on the inside. Get these, these legs back in here. All right, we took them out. Let's put you back together. All right. Don't you worry. Everything's going to be fine. Trust me. I'm a real doctor. Kind of. I forged my PhD. There we go. Good as... Good as new. <laughs> You're just like before. All right. I know that was, a, that was a bad joke, but... Apparently... I've got all my seasonings mixed together. This is, I don't even know what's in here. It's, there's cayenne pepper, there's oregano leaves, there's rosemary leaves, there's salt and pepper and garlic salt. And next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna, my oven's already preheated. I'm gonna wait for that to kind of melt a little bit more. Tells, tells me to massage the chicken a little bit, or the turkey. Get the, get the muscles loose, and then cover it in butter. Uh, or like, rub butter all over it. And then put the seasonings on it, so that's, Pretty much what I want to do, but on both sides. We got our bird nicely coated. We got our meat thermometer in here. Got it set to 165. Our oven is already preheated. We're gonna pop this thing in the oven and let it sit for I think two hours is what I said at 300 and 325 degrees. So see you in two hours. All right, we are about two hours in, uh, a little more than two hours, and I forgot to. We have to prep the stuffing to go into the turkey. So, right now I have the turkey out. So it's looking like so far, I'm getting ready to cover it. And so, I have my, my, uh, my stuffing getting ready to go in here. There's about to be chopped up to a sweet potato casserole. Once that stuffing's done, I'll put this package in there, get that going, I'll stuff that into the turkey. Throw the turkey back in for about two and a half hours. Um, and then I can start off my green bean casserole and the, let's see, I got green bean casserole, got mashed potatoes and gravy, I got, um, what are these things called? Uh, sweet potato casserole going. Uh, I got rolls, I got pie. I got it all, man. I got it all. Little update, just got everything done and prepped, ready for the oven. For whenever the turkey's, <clears throat> whenever the turkey's done. Once the turkey's done, it takes about 15 minutes to cool before you carve it, so you kind of keeps all the juices and everything in there. Um, which in that time, in that amount of time, um, everything else will be able to cook because it takes 15 to 25 minutes for everything else to cook. So I got everything prepped. I got my sweet potato casserole here. Got my green bean casserole, and I got cornbread. The rolls are up here. The pie. I got the pie getting ready to get made here. So I got the pie crust and the rolls. And then mashed potatoes, they take two minutes because they're instant ma they're instant mashed potatoes. Gravy takes another two minutes, and the stuffing takes about like three minutes, whatever, however long it takes water to boil. All right, it has been, it's already 3.30 in the afternoon. But we're on the final steps. I have uh, the casseroles going in. I have nine minutes left on those. Actually, about 15 minutes left because i got to cook for another five. Um, turkey's done. Well, our deviled eggs are done, mashed potatoes, gravy, stuffing is all done. So the only thing that's left is I got to do the pie, which is, pie takes 45 minutes, which isn't a big deal. 
and I got the, uh, the cornbread. I'll let you know, I'll give a final view of when everything's completely done. Like right now, there's my dish pile <laughs> of everything. I don't want to do the dishes, but so it's got to be done. I still got uh, rolls I got to do, and then cranberry sauce, which you just take it out, not a big deal. But well, once everything's completely done, I will give you a final view, plus my plate and whatever. Been slaving over a hot stove all day. No, I actually haven't. I've pretty much been sitting around most of the day waiting on things to cook. So, and I got the whole entire meal done, minus the pie, which the pie is in the oven, takes 45 minutes. That's my Thanksgiving meal. I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog. Fill my gut a lot. And now I'm either gonna edit this vlog or I'm gonna pass out. One of the two. But either way, I'll see you later, nerds.